Hello Leos, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. Salavi Tarot here. Let's see what is going on with your love situation at this time, guys. Let's see what's going on with my beautiful Leos. Leo, Sun, Moon, Venus signs. Of course, if you guys have not subscribed, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. And also, if you're interested in a personal reading, everything is below. My email is below. Alright guys, let's see what's going on with my Leos. Leo, Sun, Moon, Venus signs at this time. Leos. Alright. So a lot of you guys are in this position of waiting, okay? Waiting to make a decision here. For some of you guys, you may be in a situation with someone that may be coming off like a commitment phobe or this is somebody here that is not really working on the commitment as much as you are okay so someone is feeling like i'm the only one here working on this commitment for some of you guys there may be a lot of history here but i feel like in the past here leo this may be like something it's like i've been through this already or i felt like this already in the past here i've dealt with someone in the past that was possibly um constantly making me feel like I'm the only one working towards a relationship here. So I do see you guys in this position of really listening to your intuition, withdrawing, and wondering if you could really trust um, this situation or this person. So there's a big question, right? Question mark with trust. Can I trust this person? Can I trust that this is something that we could work out? Can I trust that this is something that is worth waiting for, right? Can I wait for this person? Is this something that has a lot of love okay all right let me just get one more please for you guys waiting so i see a lot of my leos you guys have definitely been patient with someone for sure like i've been patient with this person i feel like there's a lot of love here okay thank you give me some more Okay, so for some of you guys, again, it's like, I feel like this person may be keeping some sort of secrets from me, all right? Or there's something that's going on in the background that I'm not understanding within the situation. There's something that may be off for a lot of you guys, or you're feeling like something's off, right? Like, I don't feel like something's right here. For some of you guys, you found out that this person may be keeping a secret from someone, or maybe even keeping you a secret, all right? So let's dig deeper and see what's going on here, Leo. But Leo, I definitely will say listen to your intuition, because I feel like a lot of you guys are in this place of just picking up on things very clearly. But because of this, um, you know, fog at times, right? It's like, should I listen to my intuition? Does this feel right? Does this not feel right? So you guys may be just doubting your doubting yourself here. Okay. Again, with the bottom of the deck, we have the strength here. Okay. So you guys are definitely stronger than you think. All right. Very intuitive at this time. All right. So let's just look deeper and see what's going on here. What can we find out? Leo's waiting for love. All right. Let's see. Leos, please. For my Leos at this time. Leo, Sun, Moon, Venus signs. Thank you. Okay. So in the past, you guys could have been dealing with somebody that definitely came from a toxic place or was in a toxic position. Okay. You guys were dealing with somebody here. It seems like this was someone here that was looking for love, but they could have been trapped in a situation. And I feel like this person would shut you out or even shut out their own intuition, okay, at some times here. I feel like this person was very guarded, all right, very protective about something that was going on with them, all right, very scared of coming out of a situation mentally, spiritually. This person could have went through a lot in the past with their past person, could have been dealing with a Scorpio or another Taurus, all right, or there could be some sort of Taurus or Capricorn or Virgo involved in the situation. But I do feel like someone here is feeling like in the past here, um, I've been through so much and I'm just looking for love. I'm just looking to try to get out of my situation, but I feel like someone here wasn't successful here. All right. So a lot of you guys, yeah, 
Your person was possibly very hurt in the past. Someone here was very hurt in a situation. This could be you, Leo, right? In the past, someone here was very uh, dishonest. There was a lot of betrayals here. And for a lot of my Leos, you decided to really close off um, a lot of your energy, right? And decided to still give something some sort of chance, right? I'm still going to give it a chance, but I don't know if I trust this person. And again, like I said, this may be your person here, but I feel like someone here was dealing with a lot of fears and a lot of hurt that took place and they possibly kept it a secret right where I didn't really talk about how I went through so much in my past how I was hurt how I was betrayed here okay let's see what else we have here magician but this person still had faith that I'm still trying to work this out right I still have faith in love so I feel like someone here didn't want to give up here but Leo I feel like again you know you could have been dealing with somebody that was very possessive very jealous very controlling at some point right but there's a lot of fear in this person's energy okay a lot of you guys again you found out a lot of things about this person uh, possibly that this person couldn't let go of someone in the past they were still holding on to some sort of pain that happened in their past here that brought them into a very very fearful energy leo i will say it's like this person was just so scared of getting hurt again right and they possibly didn't vocalize that but i feel like this person started like projecting some of their fears into the new relationship okay because i do get a lot of toxicity here all right let's see what else we have leo's please Oh, wow. Okay, so for a lot of you guys, this was a very strong connection, but someone here started feeling like they were misunderstood or nobody understands me. And I feel like this person started like becoming quiet, backing up, not really opening up. I feel like this person became very quiet here. I felt like this person felt like they made so many mistakes in the past and they didn't want to repeat these mistakes again here. They felt very misunderstood. Or this could be you, Leo, in a relationship where you felt like someone here was not understanding where you were coming from. Because I feel like this person tried to shut you out at some point and wouldn't let you in. Although this person felt so much love for you, though. I feel like there was a lot of love here, but this person's actions was just not making you feel safe or content here okay something going on in the past here all right so let's see what's going on in this time okay during this moment here for us leos leos leo 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 someone thank you wow so a lot of you guys are at, at this time you guys are pulling away all right you guys are in this mode of, I need to heal, I need to back up, I need to really be strong. Because at some point, I feel like you guys were in this position of, I'm not too sure what to do, I'm not too sure what steps to take in this position, or this could have been your person here, not knowing what to do in a situation and not knowing um, what decision to make with this relationship. But I feel like a lot of you guys are truly pulling back at this time and just really wanting to love yourself, okay? Yeah wanting to love yourself okay although yeah although there's a lot of love here guys i feel like for some of you guys there could have been some sort of arguments here could have been some sort of back and forth but i feel like one of the biggest things here that kept you in this connection was the love that you had for this person or that you still have for this person that both of you guys still have for each other but i feel like there was just an internal battle between the both of you guys at this time it's like, how can I trust this person with my heart? How can I trust this person with, you know, moving forward here? There's still something that's blocking this connection and not allowing this connection to really grow to its greatest potential. So I see a lot of you guys withdrawing right now saying, you know what, like, I'm going to back up for a minute. As much as I miss this person, I feel like this person may miss you too here. All right. As much as I miss this person, as much as I want to be with this Sagittarius or want to be with this person, I feel like the best thing to do right now is to pull back and listen to my inner voice here. All right. For some of you guys, there may be other people involved in this connection or you feel like there's um, a blockage. All right. That's really what I'm getting here. Right. It's like for some of you guys, it's like we're constantly arguing. We're constantly going back or there's constantly some sort of um, pullback here. And I have to trust my intuition. So I feel like you guys are becoming very strong in making this decision of 
pulling back and healing again, like I said, okay? So a lot of you guys may not be speaking to this person right now, or you may be in this position where you're deciding to take things a bit slower right now, okay? Yeah. Also, for a lot of you guys at this time, you may have found out something again that really just made you rethink this connection. Like, is this connection able to grow? Am I able to work on this, right? Am I wasting my time? Someone here is really asking themselves, like, am I wasting my time? What's going on here, right? Is this person healing? Is this person working on their fears? Is this person working on their their past relationship I'm hearing? Or is this person working on something that happened to them in the past? Is this person ready to let go of their past and move over, move on to love is what I'm hearing, okay? So I feel like a lot of you guys may be opening up to this person and really expressing how you feel if you have not already, okay? But I do feel like you guys are really just loving yourself at this time, all right? Waiting for love, waiting for true love. But for some, some of my Leos right now, it's like, I'm not feeling safe is what I keep getting in this reading. I'm not feeling like this is something that is worth fighting for right now. Okay. Because I feel like someone here has to make a decision about a home. Someone has to make a decision about a family or if they want a family here, moving on from a family here, moving away from a cancer, moving away from a situation that possibly has this person tied down. Okay. Because I feel like you guys want a happy union, right? I want something that is solid. I want something that's stable. And I want somebody that is going to be a team player, right? And I feel like something has been holding someone back here, or some secrets that may be holding this person back. There are secrets in the past here, all right? Or you feel like there's some secrets. But I feel like, again, you guys are trusting your intuition. I do feel like a, a lot of my... Um, Leo's at this time, it's like, I'm really wanting to move forward, right? But I feel like something keeps pulling you back into this connection, of course, emotions, right? The love, the connection. Okay. Also get cancer energy here. Some of you guys could be dealing with another Leo or a cancer or a fire sign here. Okay. Give me something, please, for my Leo's. Someone here is waiting for someone to make a decision. Do you want to be loyal to this connection or not? Are you able to work with me or not? I'm hearing. And I feel like you guys are making a decision for someone here. Thank you. Yeah. Waiting for someone to come in and reconcile. But there's some interruptions here for a lot of my Leos. Okay. But I do see some sort of reconciliation for a lot of you guys, whether this is new love. All right. So definitely be patient, but I definitely, yeah. So you guys are manifesting in new love. All right. So definitely be patient here with the temperance. Thank you. What can my Leos expect? The sun. Yes. The sun. You guys have invested a lot of time and energy within yourself here, guys. Okay. High Priestess, you guys have invested a lot of time and energy in yourself, okay? Healing yourself, working on yourself. Do not give up on yourself, Leo. We have the sun, growth, love, truth, truth being revealed, clarity, right? Things moving in your favor, right? Thanking the universe for this amazing gift that comes in for you guys, all right? Whether this is a new person or this is someone that comes in here, someone that you've been waiting for, someone that you've been waiting to actually come in with the truth here, all right? But I will say a lot of you guys definitely be patient. Do not, do not give up at all. Don't give up because we have the high priestess here. So there's just a lot of things that you guys may not see coming. So don't sit in an energy of doubt at all. Okay. The past, definitely, I see it was a bit, um, you know, hurtful here. And there was a lot of lessons, but this was something that had to happen for someone here. All right. In order to start trusting themselves, in order to pull back here. All right. So let's just see how your person is feeling at this time. All right. Let's see how your person is feeling. Like I said, we have the sun here, guys. So again, don't give up on anything. All right. Positive thoughts at all times. Let's see how this person is feeling. How's this person feeling about... How's this person feeling about my Leo's? Wow. So you guys could be dealing with an Aries here. 
So this is someone here that wants to definitely have some sort of family with you here. Okay, a lot of you guys may be finding your person. All right, because somebody here wants this um, union with you, Leo. They feel like you are their person, whether this person wants to have children with you, wants to have a family with you, wants to, you know, move into this position of, um, you know, marriage with you here. All right. But I see this person sees your potential. All right. Could be dealing with a cancer or a Taurus or Aries here. Okay. But this is somebody here that wants to indulge in your beauty. All right. Definitely. Okay. Okay. <laughs> me leo's energy thank you but again a lot of you guys are making a decision you guys are actually making a decision to move towards stability there's someone that comes around that some of you guys may not trust all right take that how that resonates a lot of you guys just may not trust someone at this present time but i do feel like someone comes in with the truth here wanting to express something to you so okay definitely look out for that all right so let's get some messages for you guys get some messages here and i will get some all right what does my leos need to know what does my leos need to know please what does my leos need to know leo please well i know more than you think okay so a lot of you guys are in this position where it's like, I know what's going on here, okay? Something that may not be uh, said here, all right? And you're just saying to this person, I know. I know what your decision is. I know what you're planning on doing. I can still see you standing there, all right? So for a lot of my Leos, you know somebody's not wanting to let you go, all right? I will talk to you guys soon. I love you guys. Have an amazing week.